You have come back. Good. Are you prepared to go to the Academy? Then let us leave. The Master of the Academy awaits you. Greetings, prospective students. It appears we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. I met this one in the colony. Unworthy, if you ask me. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Tell me, human, what do you know of the ways of the Sith? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? A diplomatic answer, if not the core of the matter. Our power is obvious. The question in truth goes much deeper than the surface. The Jedi equate the light with goodness and strength, and the dark with weakness and evil. That is their tradition, and it is truly no surprise that they cling to it for comfort. We, however, do not treat the Force as a burden. We treat it as a gift, a thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power over others. And why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. They would tell you the dark side is too quick, too easy. All so that they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. It means not stifling yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What say you, Lasho? Are you ready to learn the secrets of the dark side? Dare you? I dare, Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash and fiery, as expected. Turn that passion to your advantage, child. What of you, Meikle? Are you ready? I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to learn more of what I speak? And so shall it be. Now then, all of you five recruits have shown a degree of facility with the Force. You all have the potential to become true Sith. Only one of you, however, will succeed. The one who succeeds will be admitted to the Academy as a full Sith. All others must wait until next year and try again, if you survive. My pupil, Euthura, shall be your teacher and master while you attempt to prove yourselves. Heed her words. As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What is an act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the Code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your one chance at true greatness lies here. Ah, there you are. My favorite prospect for the year. Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any of the others. As a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Yet, being the operative term, as I said, you have my utmost confidence. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords to the tomb of Nagasado to administer the final test. There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to 
shall we say, arrange for a change in the Academy's leadership? The tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan and Darth Malak. They discovered a star map there of great importance. Darth Malak went there? Very interesting, isn't it, Master? Reaching that map as they did is part of the final test. At any rate, it is not the tomb that is important. That Uthar will be alone is what is important. Is that such a daunting prospect? It is not as if I am asking you to perform the task alone, or as if you will get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. It is a very simple matter. My part in this is to help you gain enough prestige and slow down the progress of the other hopefuls. I want you in that tomb when the time is right. We destroy Master Uthar together and I take his place. And you take your place at my side. A beautiful plan in its sheer simplicity. I'm so glad you see it my way. I will begin to make preparations for your final test. Your only worry now is to get there. Don't disappoint me. I can help you understand it. Would you like to hear it? Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Simple words, yet easily misunderstood. Would you care for me to explain anything? I am not surprised. The Force is strong with you. Master it and it shall serve you well. About myself. I am originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Hutt. I'm sure you don't need to know more. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? We could learn much about the history of the ancient Sith, why they were on Korriban and why they left. Perhaps we could learn more about the origin of the Force itself. With that knowledge could come great power. As you wish. I did. I also said that you didn't need to know more. Why are you asking? You know all that you need to. We can exchange niceties once Uthar is gone, if you desire. Is there something else you needed? You have had an excellent start. Go, gain more prestige. Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alguin. I... oh, uh, nothing. Yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't... you know. Uh, no. No, I, I really can't. A, a Sith, like you, would use any means to succeed. Well, I, 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 I didn't mean it like that. I, I shouldn't trust you. I, I can't trust you, can I? I just don't feel I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now I, I don't know. I have so many doubts. But where would I go then? What would I do? Uh, yeah, maybe you're right. Uh, I'll go and tell Master Uthar that I'm not ready for this. Maybe it won't be so bad. Um, thank, thank you. Oh! 
You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. A duel. Fine. You run along and get ready while I go gain some prestige. Idiot. I remember you. You're all right. Trying for the academy, I see. The name's Chardin. Didn't I tell you that back in the colony? Maybe not. I don't work or play well with others. Thanks for the offer, though. I remember you. That's true. I had no idea you were coming for the academy when I met you in the colony, though. You want to challenge me? To a duel? <laughs> I've got a lot more planned than giving someone like you a fair fight. I guess we'll meet eventually, on my terms. Good luck until then. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all wrapped up. That's right. You might as well just go home, you know. There can only be one Sith this year, and that's me. You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? I could, but what would be the point in that? See you around, chump. You hanging around still? Don't you have your own... Well, you're off to a super start. You've got no more prestige than I do at the moment. Thing is, I know how to get some. Think what you like. Just remember... You take a wrong turn somewhere? Dustal, is that you? Oh, lovely. It's Father. Figures you'd show up after all this time. How did you manage to get inside the Academy? <laughs> and I'm supposed to believe that my self-righteous father has fallen into the habit of accompanying Sith in their training? I doubt that. 
Just why are you here, Father? Not for me, I hope. Couldn't you have gotten yourself blown up on some ship and spared us this reunion? Dussel, what, what are you talking about? I, I thought you were dead. Too bad you didn't still think that. Or did you really think I'd be happy to see you? Look, everyone, it's Father. Come to rescue me at long last. Sure, he may have left Mother and I to die on Telos, but that doesn't matter. No, I didn't abandon you. The task force just arrived too late. Telos was in ruins, and your mother... I, mean, I held her while... But I looked for you. I swear, I looked everywhere. Ah, oh, save it. You abandoned us long before. We were alone all during the wars. And even once you came back, you still didn't stay. I didn't have a choice. I was needed at... Yeah? Well, you were needed at home, too. You were needed when the bombing started, and I got captured. You know what? It doesn't matter. Not anymore. I have a new family now. A family that cares about me. I don't need you. The Sith? You can't mean that. No, the Sith killed your mother. The Sith destroyed Telos. So? You're the soldier, father. How many mothers have you killed? No, you've been brainwashed. The son I knew would never... You never knew me. You weren't even there to know me. So don't presume to tell me what I would or wouldn't do. I don't know what's been done to you, but you are coming with me out of here now. Touch me, old man, and I'll kill you. Get out. Get out of here before I tell the Sith that you're here. Yeah, I can just imagine what you two are up to here. Master Uthar will be more than happy to hear about it, I'm sure. Stop it, Dustal. Stop it. I won't let you go on like this. What have they done to you? They gave me a life, old man. They gave me power. You? You didn't even give me so much as a second's notice. No, no. That's not true. I was there when you were younger, but I had to leave to fight. I fought for you, for your freedom. No, you didn't. You fought for yourself, for glory. Well, the Sith can do that, too. We learned to fight and to kill. You want to see what I've learned, father? No, Dustal, don't. I don't... Too late, old man. You should have left when you had the chance. <laughs> Yes, what's on your mind? Th there's nothing to talk about. I, I failed my son, just as I failed my wife. I thought if I ever found him. I, I just can't believe he's dead. I'm not... You should have stopped him. You should have done something to prevent this. Oh, don't give me that innocent look. You can talk a hut out of his credits. You could have found a way. You could have saved him. He was my son. I wish we hadn't come. I, I, I wish I never found him. No, I did fail him, and so did you. I wish I'd never met you. I, no, I didn't mean that. Please, maybe it would be better if we just continued with the mission. I want to just take my mind off this. Saving the galaxy is what's important now. My son, I, I can mourn my son later when we're done, so let's just go. Yes, what's on your mind? If you're ready to talk, then yes, so am I. I can't hate you. I tried. 
I wanted to hold you responsible for all the things you've done. For my wife, for Telos, for Dustin. But I can't. I got the revenge I always wanted when Saul died. But it hasn't brought me the peace that I thought it would. You have a darkness inside you that must be revenue. But there's more to you as well. I see it. I know it's there. That's why I can't hate you. Why I don't want any more revenge. You don't have to be Revan. You can be so much more. Whatever the Jedi did to you, they gave you that chance. Whatever's happened up until this point, there's going to come a time very soon where you're going to have to make a choice. And there won't be any turning back. Well, then I hope I can save you from yourself. Yes, what's on your mind? You got Yes? I'm here. Maybe you can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals. Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll... Yes? What? We eat a man dieta. What are you, ma? Cava dum pa kupa. Kipuna! Cava dum. Runda di hotonga kun hunka bi. Ka chi kun ita hotonga. Puna! Pune Pudu Achuta! Kava Dumpa! Pune Pudu! Puna! Achuta! Kava dum! Kipuna! Pune pudu achuta! Kava dum! Achuta! Ach... Achuta! 
Pucha Tonga y a Fulke. Chachisco tu apunta a casa, Pupaca. Panaoto. Yes, I heard that. Excellent job. Thank you for locating the cash. Naturally, I would see rewarded, but I would prefer that everyone would leave without extracting the information. Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true city? Shall we make an issue of it? Ha! Gather your anger then, and let us see who is superior. <laughs> Now Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. You will have to work quickly if you hope to best the others. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Through passion, I gain... Through strength, I gain... Through power, I gain... Through victory... The Force shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however, two different things. Tell me then, true or false? It is our passion that fuels the Force. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. You do? That is most interesting. Where might that be? Hmm. How ironic that I recently had this vessel scrapped for parts then. I had assumed it had been thoroughly scanned. Apparently not. Still, you have done well in bringing me information that others could not unearth on their own. I am impressed. Go now. You have done well. Oh? What is my apprentice up to now? I see. It is good that you have come to me with this information, young one. It is a bit... ironic that Euthura has begun her plotting. I have been aware of her growing ambitions for some time, and had in fact already decided to remove her. Normally, the one who gains the most prestige would engage in a final trial. Two of the students would fight. This time, it will be Euthura who battles, though she does not yet know it. Perhaps it will be you who combats her. Yes, perhaps so. This is what you can do. Give this pad to Adrenus. He will put some poison in her bath. This will weaken Euthura for that final test, making her an easy target. Rather generous of me, don't you think? For coming to me with this information and betraying your foolish trainer, I feel you are worthy of prestige, young one. Go now. You have not yet impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. You have gained considerable prestige. You are very close to the end. Do not falter now. Just be careful if you go into the valley. I hear there's a herb for living in the hills that keep <laughs> Tong, 
Muchas gracias. Hold it right there, whoever you are. We're not going back to the Academy. We'll kill you rather than go back. You mean you aren't here to kill us or bring us back? I find that hard to believe. The only way into these caves is through the Academy. You must be a sick. So what is it then? If you're not here to kill us or bring us back, why are you here? Speak up! So you don't know about us? I don't know if I'm ready to believe that or not. But I'll play along for the moment. My name is Thalion May. The others here and myself refused to murder a bunch of people on a whim from Master Uthar. So here we are. We thought that becoming a Sith was what we always wanted, but that wasn't true. Now all we want is to get out of here. Fair enough? Open fire! Get them! Get them!
Thank <laughs> you. 
We've had indications that there's a whole ancient Sith colony under this valley. Oh, hello to you. You're new to the Academy, aren't you? I can't say we've ever met. Galen Lore, at your service. Aren't these tombs fascinating? We had no idea the Sith were here so long ago. I've been working on a translation of some of the runes. Argenta Paul was one of the first of the great... These runes claim that he was interred here. According to legend, Argenta Paul... Certainly. A few of the books. Nothing at all. The lead. Of course.
again the human beware of this this spirit it may not be what it appears great emotion lies within do i know you it seems as if we have met before i do and yet i do not the force is so strong with you human yet the face the soul oh, it has been so very long i had a name once. Ajunta Paul. Yes, that was my name. I was one of many. We were servants of the dark side. Sith Lords, we called ourselves. So proud. In the end, we were not so proud. We hid. Hid from those we had betrayed. We fell, and I knew it would be so. temple, our tomb, built far from our enemies. We revered power and threw off the teachings of our old masters. It, we were not the first to fall to the dark side, but we had more power than those before us. It came from elsewhere. Our oldest secret, only, only we would know. We lords, only we would know where our power came from. The force no longer touches my mind, human. And even if it did, I, I no longer remember our secret. The force, what have you, 
Or did you? Or will you? Oh, uh, so many images. I see your dark heart, human. So much power, it is blinding. We hid from the Jedi. We destroyed each other. We desired the secrets of each other to increase our power. We battled. And so, here, our old secret is buried, and none of us hold it anymore. Is that not right? Our power fled. Oh, what became of us? Do, do the Sith still thrive? Did they ever return? So much, so much time. My sword, I filled it with... I am dead as my faith is dead. Of course you do. You... I wish my sword to be taken away from me. There are three blades within my sarcophagus. Only find the sword that is mine and place it on the stone. Then you must die. This is how it must be. I do remember one thing of my sword. Listen to me carefully. I am that which grips the heart in fright. Harkens night and silences the light. It was written of my sword. Go then. Find my... Yes, that is the one. That is the blade that destroyed me. Take it. Take it and the other blades even. Take them and go. My darkness awaits me. Our oldest secret is buried, but not... Do not let the dark flame guide you, young one. all the way to the sarcophagus. Good to see I wasn't wrong. Isn't it obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work in retrieving the sword of Ajunta Paul for some time. It's been quite a wait. Now that you have it, I just thought I'd relieve you of it. It must be quite a burden after all. Nice try. I may not know what the sword looks like, but I'm no gullible fool. I'm not about to pass up a chance to impress Master Uthar. I may like you well enough, but being a Sith is all about taking chances when the moment is right. So make it easier on both of us. Hand over the sword. Need to do things the hard way, eh? Fine by me.
You? You have the sword. The sword. Ah, yes, it's the same old story, is it? I would fight you for the sword. Still, it would be wonderful if I could get a chance to study. Greetings. I don't think I've seen you at the air. A star map. All right. You should be careful if you're planning on entering this. There's an assassin draw.
I heard an explosion in there. Did you destroy the assassin droid? Well, if you did, then I wouldn't have to think about going inside after all. I suppose, at any rate, if you haven't already, you might want to go and see Master Uther. Sorry, I'm rather busy with the excavation planning right now.
Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? Well, the contact nerve toxin in the air should knock you out quickly enough. <laughs> Welcome. Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Horde, if you don't know. I've taken up residence here for now. It's dusty and full of critters, but it's home. Oh, <laughs> spiteful little thing, aren't you? Let's not forget him. Who has who? No, 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 no. Let's keep things on a more civilized note, shall we? Now then, introductions are oh, this other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name is Miko. Say hello, Miko. <laughs> Poor lad. He's had a hard day. My name is Jorak Earl. I was once the head of the academy, so I'm sure you've heard of me. Oh, my, my, my! Such glorious... Anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. You see, most of the Drek Uthar has been passing through these days is so pathetic. Take young Miko here. I already... Yes, yes, you're welcome. You see... <laughs> then I'd say you have quite an imagination. Not a bad thing. Well, forgive me for resorting to the cliché, but you would... Now, now, is that any kind of attitude to take with higher education? I'm doing... So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get it right? And I torture Miko. Miko here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much. I don't know what you think of Miko. Maybe you don't like him. No hesitation before the kill? Now that's what I'd like to hear. Well then. We can both of now, now, dear lad, do you really think you're... And how many correctly answered questions before you die? On that note, let's... Now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? Incorrect. Do that and no one is in command. You derive no benefit from the kill at... Ah! And so we come to round two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you... The humans would no doubt just be preyed upon by something else later. Stand up for yourself, I say! Sadly, Miko, the in... Excellent. Ah, yes. You discover an aspect of the Force that gives you great power. Do you share it and strengthen the Sith as a whole? Or keep it to yourself? Correct! Let them rip the secret from your cold, dead hands if they are strong enough. Oh, certainly you might share it. Well, it's sad to say... Still going? All right, then. One of your underlings has made a major mistake which makes you look bad. He's probably very competent and skilled. Do you kill him or give him another chance? Correct. Publicly, if you can. There is no room for that level of failure. Not killing him would be seen as a sign of weakness. And then, where would you be? Ah, Miko. Ah! Oh, Miko has gone and died on us. Well, is young Miko dead? I suppose you... I think you must have cheated a little. But there's nothing wrong. I'll just give you a Perhaps we'll meet again soon. Oh! <laughs>
Sorry, I can't talk. Be careful of the Tukata. These tombs, the, we've had indications that there's a whole Careful of the Tukata. It's all we can do to keep those beasts away. Back again? Something... Oh, Jahani, is that you? Deck? That is you, isn't it? I, I... I hardly recognized you. It's been a long time, Jahani. What are you doing here? Did you fall to the dark side? I didn't fall, Jahani. I had my eyes opened. And don't look at me like that. Last I recall, you were having your own doubts. I was. I'm not anymore. Deck, you could... Save it. The Jedi aren't for me. Not anymore. I don't want to know. It's better that I don't. In fact, I'll just get out of here and leave you to whatever... Running away? Why not? It's what I do best. Does it matter? I'm going. Isn't that enough for you? Let him go. He won't say anything. Look, I don't want to be here after you leave. There'll be too many... A star map? No. I haven't heard anything about... Sort of. Goodbye, Dak. Goodbye, John. How may I be of assistance to you? Of the tomb on the far left. Sorry, I can't talk. We have to excavate this valley with hand and Sorry, I can't. We have to excavate this valley with hand and strength. Sorry, I'm rather busy.
the excavation plan. Do not forget our agreement regarding Euthura's treachery. We sh Ah, the ones I ordered executed for their mutiny. Indeed, I had the... The lesson is learned. Go now, you have done well. Yes, so I hear. I've had reports from some students that ventured into the tomb after you left. I am impressed. You, you have impressed me enough, by my estimation, to become... You have but one final test which you must take, and this... I would advise you to be rested and equipped. When you return, make sure that you have all you will need. So then, I take it you are ready to travel to the tomb of Nagasado. Then we go. Very well. We are now ready for your final test, young... Indeed you have. Is that a tone of mischief in your voice, dear Euthora? You should know by now that no scheme is certain. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about, Master. I am not scheming. Should we not get on with the test? Yes. Yes, of course. We are in the sick. You are to follow in their footsteps and reach the... The lightsaber is for you, your initiation present. Be very cautious here. This tomb is... Do you understand what I have told you? Good. You.
Saber in hand, as I knew you would. The Force has served you well. You took a great risk in acquiring the artifact. You used your mind and your power. No peaceful meditation, no passive. Sometimes you must fight in order to achieve. That is the lesson we teach with that. Good. The last part of your test will now. All life must compete in order to flourish. Such is the natural. So it is the same amongst the Sith. So it behooves you in this final test to strike down one you are familiar with for no other reason than to prove you are superior. Normally, this would be against another student. You, however, get a special... What? So this is what you had planned all along? You wish me killed? Indeed. You have become too ambitious, Uthura. It is time for you to die and someone more... talented. No. It is time for you... Sadly, Uthura, it is you who are mistaken. You are indeed a fool if you think to oppose us. But to think that I actually hope this makes no sense. You betrayed. She is a spy. Do not fret, my dear. All will be as it. You will pay for this. You.
You there. How is it that you're leaving Nagasadao's tomb by yourself? You went in for your final test, didn't you? Where is Master Uthar? You lie! You could never have killed the Master. You are not Revan. Quick, attack the traitor! But even if it's not Revan, what if Master Uthar is actually dead? If Master Uthar is dead, then he was a weak... <laughs> the Sith from the Academy.
Thank <laughs> you. 